Where's wellies from, Mo? <laughs> I found them in the shuttle. I had those since I was 15, those wellies. Really? Yeah. So they're mine. <laughs> now they're mine. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone, and welcome back. I do apologise for being away for a while, but I really needed a break from... Uh, from filming and stuff like that. So I decided to take it while we had a few family um, parties and stuff going on. But we're back, back to the vlogs. And today we've got um, an important job because, let me just flip the camera around. So the horse's beds are becoming very expensive to maintain. So what we've decided to do is change over to straw and you can see the bed's really dirty at the moment because we've left it to use up all of the all of the shavings. And now today we're going to empty them all out and they're going to get nice straw beds instead. So the reason why we're doing the straw is because the farmer behind the chateau has offered to give it to us for free, like he does with the hay because he cuts the hay from our field every summer. So it's going to be a lot cheaper and uh, because at the moment it's costing me probably around 350 250 I think between yeah 250 to 300 a month just on their bedding and that's a lot of money so yeah we're gonna switch over to straw for now and uh, see how they go they're probably gonna eat all of the straw in the bed because the straw is really a good quality so they might not have any bed left in, during the during the night but there we go we're going to give it a try
You know what? They will eat it, but I don't think they'll eat a lot of it. And it's a lot healthier than uh, hay. Hay is very fattening. If you've got a horse that's very overweight or a bit sick because they're overweight, you feed them that because it's a lot less uh, fattening. I think they're going to enjoy their beds a lot better than the shave. Well, looks more comfortable than shavings. I'm oh. jealous. Go on, lie down, see if it's I'm comfy. I'm jealous. Oh. Is it comfy? Oh, <laughs> oh. They're going to be happy. Because for the last oh. week, oh. I didn't put any, and they needed mucking out properly last week. And this week, I've left the bed to get really dirty so that when I empty it all out, I wasn't wasting any clean stuff. So they've had little horrible beds for a week. Really comfy. And now they've got this lovely straw. And I think... A big strawberry. They're going to be very happy. <laughs> Are you staying there, Mo? No. <laughs> I like it. Yeah? <laughs> you need to fluff it all back up now. No. Yeah, you made it all flat. Done. Yeah, New Day has got a really nice big bed too. We just need to make hay nets and then it's all ready for them to come in tonight. Look at that. Look at the state <laughs> we are. We are filthy and dirty. I'm wet, Very but dirty. we have finished. What's the yeah. time, Mo? It's two. Two? Yeah. It's quarter to two, and we started at ten. Ten, yeah. About half nine, ten o'clock. Yeah. So, <laughs> and we had one coffee in between in Michael's coffee. So we're just going to back out yeah. to get the horses in because it's the time we get them in. And Mo's <laughs> Mo's topped off the wellies with the coat. I'm doing Sadie. It's still Halloween. <laughs> and he's got little Bertie. Come on. Yeah, I'm just going to grab a towel quickly for the horses.
Just now started to yeah, rain. Rain in half. <laughs> so they are absolutely soaking wet. You got it soaked out there. It is just literally started really raining hard. <laughs> Hence why we're here getting them in. Oh, she hasn't taken any interest in her new bed yet. <laughs> she definitely will later. Look at the steam coming off of her where she's all hot, yeah. where she's drying off naturally. Thank you. 